Crabman here from Crabman Gaming, and today I am playing Big Bash Boom on the PS4, released by Big Ant. It's the game that came after Ashes Cricket. Here we've got the Big Bash or the Women's Big Bash League. It's really the only thing you can pick from. A big arcade style cricket game. So namaste to all of my subscribers and any new people watching the video today. Please flick a quick like if you're enjoying this video down the bottom and if you comment I'll try my best to get back to you. Now you've got the BBL 09 tournament, uh, you can do 08 online, customise some stuff, get some celebrations going, some mini games. Alright, that's the match I was going to do. Let's do Scorchers versus... Mm, let's do the Melbourne Stars. So it was released in November of 2018. I did find my copy in really the bargain bin for $4. So it didn't stay expensive for long. Generally cricket games will stay pretty expensive. And that was a pretty substantial loading screen. So I'll leave you with the intro. Tonight's big bash match is between the Perth Scorchers and the Melbourne Stars at Optus Stadium. Oh, that's the toss. Please bowl first. Gee, that thing scares me. What's that? Oh, they're going to bowl. Let's see if they can keep the runs to a minimum. I'm scared of whatever that thing was. There's no blaze from the Scorchers. Now I've got Yakel Ajibhai. It's my little wink, wink, nod, nod to you today. It's like big head mode in NBA Jam, but the whole time I played one, three, three match, and it is just absolutely bizarre. That looks like Dale Stain. Who's this batting for the Scorchers? Klinger. Curtis Patterson. Oh, the Pats. I don't know why the Scorchers signed him. Very average T20 player in my opinion. Alright, so you can press ready. You've got advance. You've got loft. I don't know why you'd want to do anything apart from loft. The six first ball. I'm going to give you a, a bit of a hint. There's probably going to be a lot of sixes. Celebrations. I only remember how to do one, which is the aeroplane. Like, I get the idea of the game and I kind of give them credit for giving something new a go, but I can just see how this could get old very quickly and after maybe one afternoon with the game, you probably wouldn't really want to play it again. And I know it was set to easy, but I always play these games on the default setting as well. So hopefully you are enjoying the video. If you do comment, I'll do my best to comment back. Boom, there's three sixes in a row. We're going for the Gary Sobers in the very first over, or the Herschel Gibbs, or the Yuvraj Singh. I'm not celebrating every ball. You can learn some of the other celebrations in the menu. So if I have a look here, celebrations, I can try and remember some of them, but I don't want to be too long. What's the bat, baby? Oh, flick. All right, let's flick it. Send this one back over the bowler's head. I don't know why. Defense, I don't know why you'd want to def pretty much ever defend in this game the firework sound gets pretty annoying after about five minutes as well oh left flick left flick here's the bat baby yeah that's it's interesting but i don't know how often you'd want to do that maybe after about twice in innings it's Kind of already been done. There's the fifth six in a row. Whoa, that's what I like to see. I'm guaranteeing you fireworks in this three over affair. We might even get the maximum score. Here's a power up. You do L2 and R2 for a power up. Did it do it? Runs and coins worth double. Double runs. If they're ruthless, they can hit a maximum of 12 from the next ball. Is it is it just for one ball? Some of the other power-ups I've done, you get it for th you get it for three balls. Oh, it's a twelve! Yes. Twelve runs and over is pretty good, but how about twelve runs in one ball? I just I'm almost speechless playing this game. It's a, it's entertaining for you. Oh, there's a trophy that must have been for the double runs. Cam Bancroft. Who's he facing off against? Dale Stain, it looks like. No, Nathan Coulter Nile. Oh, traitor, he went to the stars. 
There's another six. I do like Nathan Coulton. I was very upset when he left the Scorchers and went to the Stars. Patterson, 42 off his six deliveries. It's just a six fest. We may even get more than six a ball here. Oh, what a shot. <laughs> it's another six. A maximum for the batter. It's raining sixes. Nicely done. Jogging along well. It's the 50 up after just eight deliveries. So this does have a Metacritic of just 55 as well. Here's another power play. Another power up. Shot strength doubled. I've had this one before. I think this goes for three deliveries. Watch out in the stands, people. Let's try and whip this through the leg side. Let's at least play something different for you, for you guys. Ideal timing. Boom! It is Big Bash Boom. Boom that out of the stadium. Oh, it's out of the stadium! What a shot! Oh, that's worth a celebration. I can only remember that baby one. All you can do is sit back and admire the beauty of the celebration following that huge shot. Oh, Cam Bancroft. How far was that? 140 plus metres. It was out of Optus Stadium, if that's where we are. I think we are. I think we're at Optus. The stadium in Perth. Oh, it's another huge hit. It's raining sixes. It's out of the stadium again, 147 metres. The crowd will be enjoying grabbing... Surely there was a trophy for hitting it out of the stadium. A little rice smile from Bancroft. Look for the top of off. I don't know why there are any fielders in the circle unless they have to be. I can't even see what's happening with the field. Oh, it's off the toe, but it doesn't matter. With the double power. Out of the stadium again, 157 metres. It's like Brett Lee at the MCG back in... 2002, whenever that was. Or Aiden Blizzard at the Wacker. Search that up, that's good fun. Aiden Blizzard, six at the Wacker, out of the stadium. In the, uh, well, before it was the Big Bash, it was the state competition. Boom. And he hit a that's massive, a massive shot out of the ground at the Wacker. It's not a super over, but that was a super over. Zampa, he's on. The Love Guru. You've seen, if you want to watch something, watch Stoiners and Adam Zampa make coffee in their room. Fielders throw slower. Well, I, I don't think that really matters. It's not really going to be important at all. Oh, what's that thing floating around the sky? Oh, okay. I didn't even know what that was. Oh, that was quick. Maybe he had one of his own. Revenge. Doesn't matter. It's been dispatched. What's the score? 84 after just 2.1 overs the bats on fire everyone's on fire this is just pure carnage I thought cricket 2007 had uh, some high run rates but yeah definitely watch that it is uh, Adam Zampa and making coffee for Stoyness when they're on tour which is just amazing it's so amazing they're like BFF's best friends forever. Example of Stoinis. There's also a video of them op shopping as well, if you can find that. That is so funny. They just go op shopping around Melbourne just looking for retro clothes. That's pretty cool as well. Here he is, Adam Zampa. Yeah, nearly pressed the wrong button. It's raining sixes again. A few balls left in the innings. He's trying to um, get back in. Well, he wants to play test cricket for Australia. There's the 100 partnership or a 50 or something. It's Is it a 50? Is it a partnership? Is it the 100? Yeah, it's the 100 up. Oh, he missed Patterson's 50. But he has only taken three first-class wickets in two years, and his, his first-class average is around 50. So he's got some work to do if he's going to be the backup spinner to Nathan Lyon. I'm going to try Mitchy Swepson, but um, yeah, I don't think he's the future. Invisible wickets. Oh, it's like he's giving birth. Or going Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan, the stumps are gone. Yep. Oh, hang on, that might not even be a six. That's a wicket. 
The fielding team will be happy to finally get the wicket. Oh, it's the first non-six. Oh, look at Dale Stain. Didn't even bowl, but he's hulking up Hulk Hogan style. Yes. Let me now let me tell you something, brother. I know I haven't bowled today, but I've taken the catch. Oh, I did bowl. I bowled the first over for 42, brother. And I've saved my prayers and I've eaten my vitamins. And what you're gonna do when Stainomania runs wild on you? Stars need 109 from 18 balls. Curtis Patterson out of the final ball of the innings. 72 off 12. Bancroft, 36 off 6. Well, could hardly do any better unless you've got the double run bonus. This game is outrageous. It's contagious. It's all happening. Ben Dunk, the Dunk Man, currently playing in the Caribbean Premier with Chris Lynn. In comes the Dorf Man. Jason Berendorf. Kind of a doppelganger for John Cena. We've got two slips in for reasons I do not understand. I think you've got to get it into that blue zone. Oh, hot. Hit that for six, Dunky. He's opening with Hilton Cartwright. That's not the opening combo they have now. Where's their um? Where's their where's the scorecard? Mm, summary. Who usually opens the batting? Uh, no, not Nick Madison. He, oh, Stoinis. Stoinis has been opening, of course, because he's got that 147. Maybe it was 157. Yes. Oh, there's six catch. Opening the batting, and that's why Stoinis can't get in the T20 side for Australia because Finch and Warner are the openers. And Stoinis opens for the Stars. Catch that! I like how the umpire is the same as well. If you look at the umpire, it's the same as the Ashes Cricket umpire. And I'm pretty sure he's the Cricket 19 umpire as well. Because I've seen him around a lot. He gets around. Well, that's six. It's a flat six. So after this, we've just got Cricket 19 to come for the Cricket videos. And then it's uh, back to Cricket Captain for a little bit. That's out of here! And then, really, after that, I'm not sure what I'm up to after that, cricket wise. Or game wise. I've been meaning to get back into the wrestling videos for a while. But I know I've got a strong cricket following. Catch! Oh, I've got to move the thing. Gone. Well, that didn't work out. Let's do that rocking celebration with him. Oh, I didn't have one. Who caught that? Was it Mitchell Johnson? Is he still in this game or had he retired by then? Oh, didn't tell me. Hilton Cartwright, let's uh, let's hoop one in. Big big in swinger, big in swing New Yorker. Yep. Oh, that's high. That's going to be caught. First ball. Oh no, we're going to move the stick. Gone. Bang bang. No, that's not a gun going off. That's the sound of two wickets falling in succession. <laughs> Oh, and in comes Maxwell, one of my favourite players, Glenn Maxwell. If you've got a favourite player, post below who they are. Here's Glenn Maxwell, the big show. They used to play the big show's entrance music when he used to come out. To bat. Oh, he's beaten Maxi. The ball was nowhere near the keeper, but it goes into the gloves anyway, because this game just does not matter. He looks like AJ Ty bowling, number 68 himself, in the Australian ODI T20 bubble but does not have a state contract, which doesn't really matter because he was never too good. I know he played a few one days for Australia. Oh boy, they've gone up strong for this one. Oh, the peel, there's the arm. Was never really that strong for WA in the one day format. But um, still has a Scorchers contract, so they're going on. He's not going to play any of the one dayers, but he might play some of the T20s. Where's Blaze? The pitch is on fire. He's on fire, NBA Jam style. Oh, boom shakalaka. It's all happening here. The tension, the drama, the buzz, the atmosphere, the crowd. He's going to hit one right off the mid of the bat in a minute. Oh, that's close. Appeal anyway. There's Blaze giving me the double thumbs up. To stop runs. Hopefully we do see some big hits soon, though. Straight. Let's go full and straight. Oh, it's gone through a bit like Daryl East, like about to go right over the top. That was an extremely business. Because it's all going on. I think we've got this game wrapped up. 
uh, let me see, the stars need, I don't know, 87, 88 off just six deliveries. In comes Jai Richardson. Let's, oh, whoops, didn't mean to bowl it there. Slow one on the pegs. Oh, block. Glenn Maxwell, you crab. Dot balls are usually a good thing, but I'd really prefer runs. Yeah, well, there's not many of them out here after we finish batting. Yep. So it pushes one for four. Oh, it doesn't even go for four. What's happening? I didn't even realise I had to throw it in. You can see X for the... Um, Look like I don't know which end. I thought that was the bowler's end or the keeper's end. I don't. I don't really know. We'll be after a few gaps. Just putting the ball on a good length. Yep. Great. Shot. More of a half volley it's length. Runs. Get it in. Yeah, circle for the bowler. Well, this game is winding down to a conclusion. Quite a short game, and really, I don't. I don't know if I'm ever going to pick it up. Three free hits. Peter Hanscom, well he needs one because he's none of five. Oh, he's missed the first one. I love how the keeper is nowhere near the ball as well. No ball! We'll have to bowl a good ball not to be smashed on the free hit. I don't know why that was a no ball. I'm pretty sure I pressed the button before the line. Oh, Hanscom, he can get nowhere near it. Numpty. Important runs missed. There's Jai Richardson. My goodness, Peter Hanscom, way to ruin a good game. I can't even get bat on the ball. I can't even bowl him either. I'm just I'm just gonna bowl this full on the stumps. Oh, it's wide. Surely a wide, or is that the game? Yes, it's a wide. There's old mate, he's umpiring all the games. Here comes the final delivery. Thanks for joining me today. Please like this video if you haven't. Leave a comment. And if you subscribe, well, I may even do more videos. Oh, no. Maxwell. Poor Maxwell stranded. Hanscom, you are rubbish. The Scorchers win. Mitch Marsh, you did nothing. But it doesn't matter. The fireworks are off. Until next time. Tie bowl to Maiden. One for none. 85 run victors. Well, 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 pure annihilation here in Big Bash Boom. Thanks for joining me today. Ash Nagar, he had nothing to do. Hanscom, none off nine. So thanks for joining me. If you've enjoyed cricket videos, if you like cricket videos, subscribe to the channel. If you like random videos, just have a look anyway. Give it a thumbs up, give it a like. See you later for the next video. Have a wonderful day. Farewell.